What's going on, everybody? Crit CDJ here, ready to bring you episode number seven of our Pokemon Christmas Nuzlocke. Last episode, we actually uh, lost our first member, and I had forgotten because <laughs> I mean I edited it. I edited it. Edited the edited the video. <laughs> Um, after, you know, we lost the guy, and I was not thinking 100%, I was just kind of a little disappointed that we, uh, lost our, uh, our, what, well, our t newest team member, Tensel, and I was really looking forward to using an Onyx, I do like Onyx, um, and I was, you know, he had been a great Pokemon, you know, as soon as he learned, which I think he was like one level away from learning a, uh, Rock-type move. And he would have been a great for this gym. Um, but it was not meant to be, apparently. And he died to a Butterfree. Which, if you didn't see it, you know, obviously I just ruined everything. But, you know, go watch it and see for yourself. Um, I had a little issue with the speed up button again. Which I've had issues in the past. Which brings me to... If you want to see um, where I basically started having issues with the speed up button, go watch uh, Best of Crit CDJ Part Two, uh, Mega VG Master. Uh, go ahead and put that together, um, and it's you know he does a really good job. It's really kind of cool. Um, you know it's it's a little bit lengthy. I think it's like 45 minutes or something like that. Um, you know watch it in segments if you don't want to watch it all. You know, but it's it's definitely good. It's, you kind of get to see where I come from. You know, what my first you know thing was. Um, and you don't have to watch the whole series yourself because it's like, you know, 30-something episodes. So, you know, this will shorten it up for you. Um, anyway, so that was last episode. This episode, we are ready to take on Bugsy here uh, for our first gym badge. I'm sorry, second gym badge um, through, of this playthrough. And as I said before, I went ahead and did a little bit of the grinding. So let's go ahead and take a look at those Pokemon. Whoops. Oh, by the way, Mega VG Master, um, the uh, the link to the uh, to part two is in the description, so that you can you know check that out from there. Anyway, I went ahead and leveled Peppermint up to level twelve, and we've got Tackle, Defense Curl, Powder Snow, and Sand Attack. And I just remembered, I was supposed to I was gonna change somebody's name. Whose name was I gonna change? Whose name was I going to change? Oh, I was going to change Sandshrew's name uh, to Snowglobe. Because uh, I thought that was a pretty, you know, kind of a cool nickname for him. Uh, he's not on the team anyway, so it doesn't matter. I'll have to, I'll, here, I'm going to leave myself a note to do that off screen. Alright, there we go. Anyway, we've got Rocco the Christmas Bat here, level 12. With the experience here, that way he can gain some levels, because, I mean, right now he's kind of, I mean, Bite's not bad, but he's kind of worthless, let's be honest. Um, Zubat's not the greatest. We got Present here, still waiting for him to pick up some presents for us. Um, he picks up presents all the time while I'm grinding. Um, anyway, he's got Headbutt, um, Ice Punch, Mud Slap, and Sand Attack. We've got Poinsettia here. Uh, holding the Miracle C with Vine Whip, Growth, Wrap, and Flash. And I actually do need to remember to take off Flash. So, let me write that down. Um, as, I, as, as I've mentioned in the previous episodes, and maybe as you've seen for yourself, there is a Move Deleter and a... Um, a name raider in every single one of our Pokemon or uh, Pokemon centers that we've seen. At least, you know, that, like I said, at least that we've seen. Uh, we got Rudolph here, um, level 15, almost level 16. He only needs 39 more experience points. He's got no Ranberry, just in case. With Mudslap, Leer, Smokescreen, and Ember. And then we've got Fishmas here, level 20, our highest level. And the only reason why I did that is because I wanted a Gyarados. So I went ahead and if you you know if you didn't see the previous episodes. Uh, basically, I went ahead and just left the experience share on him until he turned into a Gyarados. And he's got Splash, Tackle, and Bite. And that is our team. We are ready to take on Bugsy. I'm Bugsy. I never lose when it comes to bug Pokemon. My research is going to make me the authority on bug Pokemon. Let me demonstrate what I've learned from my studies. Right, here we go. Second gym battle. Alright. So he's got three Pokemon. He's going to send out Butterfree first. Perfect. 
Level 15, okay. Not perfect. We should be okay to take on whatever attack he has. String Shade, he's gonna slower our speed, which he outspeeds us anyway, so that's perfectly fine. So much of Powder Snow does. Okay, that's not very much. We are getting the heck out of here. And we're going to go into Rudolph. If I have to, I'll go into um, Fishmas or Gyarados. If I have to, just in case. Because um, he is he's probably going to be higher level than all of these Pokemon. Okay. So we'll be able to take it out with two um, Embers. L luckily, he missed the Stun Spore. Because that would have kind of sucked. We might just stay in with Rudolph and just sweep this gym with Rudolph. Make it easier on ourselves. Rocco gaining some experience. Do I want to switch out? I mean, it'd be nice to get other Pokemon experience, but do I really want to right now? You know what? I do. I think we'll be alright. I'm going to, again, see how much a Powder Snow does. It'll probably do about the same. Um, as it did against Butterfree, but I want to see. I feel like Beedrill can do even less than, um, uh, less to us than uh, a Butterfree can. I'm going to do another one. He misses his Fury Attack. Kind of hoping to get maybe a Freeze, that'd be nice. No, alright, I am not standing though, because it's not doing a thing. Luckily, we got Rudolph here. Um, I don't know what we would have done if we'd picked a, uh, a Chikorita to start out with. Whoops, I didn't mean to hit Smoke Screen. Oh well. Now he maybe missed some stuff. Like that. That'll work. Ember's what I wanted. Alright. Poison Sting, don't poison us. Okay, good. I mean, you know, knock on wood. Um, hacks so far are kind of in our favor with him missing um, stun spore earlier, then missing, or then getting the poison sting, not getting poisoned, um, missing a couple fury attacks. So so far, Scyther, I am not switching out on a Scyther. I'm gonna stay in. That's scary. Fury cutter. What's that gonna do? That was a crit, even. Okay, so we're good. We should be good. Okay, that's a three-hit KO. If he keeps going for his Fury Cutter, I'm not worried. Wait, didn't that do, like, the same amount as it did when I was a crit? I feel like it did. And there's our Oranberry. So, yeah, we're just fine. There we go, and down goes the Scyther. Alright, so... I was hoping to use other Pokemon than just Rudolph in this, but, you know, we did, we did what we had to do, basically. So, you know, I didn't want to lose anybody again. Um, uh, just a second. I forgot to write down um, what time we started. Hopefully that's close enough. Alright, anyway. You're an expert on Pokemon. My research isn't complete yet. Okay, you win. Take this badge. And we got 1,700 Poke Dollars. And we got the Hive Badge. Do you know the benefits of a Hive Badge? If you have it, Pokemon that know Cut will be able to use it outside of battle. Here, I also want you to have this. And we got TM49, which is what? So the last team we got didn't make any sense. It was Mud Slap from a flying type gym. No sense at all. What is this one? Fury Cutter. That is at least a bug move, I believe. I think it's strong with that. Ah, why it gets stronger every time you use it. That's right. Um, isn't that great? I discovered it. So, that's why it did more after that crit. Um, hey, look at that. I told you. See, present does have pickup. There it is. That's the proof right there. 
And we got a rare candy. Nice. I'm gonna hold off on using that until until uh, Rudolph. Let me see how much experience does he have. Yeah, he's almost ready to go up to level 17. Once he gets to level 17, I'll use that to put him up to 18. Uh, what was I, oh yeah, I was gonna look see who can learn Fury Cutter if I want to teach it to anybody. The question is, do I want to actually teach it to somebody? Present can learn it, and so can Rudolph. Let's teach it. Well, no. No. Ah. I do not want to learn... Because he's already got four attacking moves. And so I think we're going to teach it to Rudolph. Because Rudolph does have... He's got one move I don't think we'll ever use. And TMs are... Um, pretty sure I'm limited in this game. I can use it as many times as I want to. Yeah, we got Leer here. So I don't know if we'll ever use that. But you know, it's there in case we need it. Um, what's his... I forget what his physical attack is like. Is it any good? Because I'm pretty sure... Whoops. Let's see. So, it's yeah, it's about the same. 30 and then 33 for special attack. So it's about the same as a, as a special. It's not much different. Anyway, let's get out of here. Let's go heal up. And then if this is like the original... Ah, uh, gold game. We'll have, I believe we'll have a rival battle coming up, won't we? Don't you have a rival battle right, before, right after the uh, gym? Or maybe it's before the gym. Either way, it's coming up. Well, here, let's, let's go see what's on this berry tree over here. Alright, there we go. I was going to say we should get some balls from Kurt, but I forgot we already bought a bunch of those last episode. Alright, so yeah, here's our rival. Jason, is it true? Has Team Rocket really returned? Wow, you beat them? That's amazing. I won't be I won't be much of a match compared to them, but but could we battle? So yeah, so there's our rival battle. So Nancy wants to send out a zigzagoon at level 12, so that's not bad. So maybe we're supposed to take this, uh, take her on before we take on, uh, the gym. Because, I mean, you know, obviously her Pokemon is lower. I don't know. Let's see how much Headbutt's going to do. A lot. That was a crit. And we flinched. Alright, let's get on Switch Out. Um, you know what? Let's send in Present. We'll take our Zigzagoon versus her Zigzagoon. See who can win. Headbutt. Oh, stop it with the crit! Oh my goodness. Alright, I might need to switch out. I can take another one. We should be faster. We're not faster. Okay, she lo they lowered our attack. Okay, so it's a speed tie, even though I'm a level higher. Oh, that was stupid, that was stupid, that was stupid. Because he lowered my defense, yep. Oh, there goes present, guys. Oh. Come on. Oh. We lost another Pokemon. Back to back episodes, we lose a Pokemon. Oh. Oh, my goodness. A Vulpex. Yeah, I'm gonna switch out. You know what? I'm getting tired of this. Let go, Fishmas. Oh, that's ridiculous. Bite. Yeah, take that. Wow, I was expecting that to, to just take it out. But hey, you know, that's fine with me. About to use a Meryl. Um, go on, Poinsettia. 
Ugh. How? I can't believe we lost present. I was starting to... Uh oh. I was really starting to like present. I mean, with the pickup ability and stuff. Alright, you stop that. You stop that right now, Mario. Got a crit at least. I got a heal though. Miss! Oh, I think we're gonna die. Do I have anything better than a potion? Do I have a super potion yet? I have a full restore. Super potion, there we go. Miss your rollout! Come on! I... Yeah. Down goes Poinsettia. Alright, this does like to be a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. I need to do a lot more grinding. I've been grinding in between episodes. But that's not enough, apparently. <sighs> Even though I lost, I still love to battle. It helps you to learn what you can improve, you know? Maybe next time I'll be a better match for you. You all oh, don't start with me. In the meantime, never stop your training. I'm going to keep it up at it, too. Maybe one day I'll be even stronger than you. you are. See you later, Jason. Best of luck, Kina. Screw you too. <sighs> All right. So we lost present. And we lost Poinsettia, but I need to take off that item from Poinsettia. Take off her, uh... Miracle Seed. Oh, I'm so disappointed. So, two Pokemon down? Well, three Pokemon down, technically. Whoops. Alright, so we already have, we still have a ground type, so I'm going to leave him in there. Um, I could take out Bumble, but I don't really want to use a Rattata. We're going to go ahead and take out Eric Carl, though. So we got a Beedrill. Um, he can probably learn, uh, what's it called? Fury Cutter. Yes, he can. So we'll teach that to him. At least that way it's stab. Let's get rid of string shot. So I will definitely use. I'd be more likely to use harden than string shot. And then we got another encounter coming up. Hopefully it's something good. Okay. So let's see. I will go ahead and take off. The experience share on Rocco. We'll move Eric Carl up two seconds. Oops. And we'll give Eric Carl the experience share. And then let's see, Rudolph. No, he did not gain a level. Okay. Um, I do want to give him, though... I still have an Oranberry, right? Yes. Give that to Rudolph. Alright, now let's go. Oops. Alright, that is Dupes, even though he died. Dupes. Caterpie. 
another bug Pokemon. I do like Caterpie better than Weedle. And I'm pretty sure I've already said that. I think Caterpie can live a tackle. I know it's pretty weak, but yeah. But Peppermint's really not that strong. Alright, let's go ahead and capture him. And I think I'm going to leave him in here. Um, yeah, and I'll probably take out Eric Carl. Um, what do we want to name him, though? I'm trying to remember some of the names. Um, I think v uh, Mega VG Master was the only one that gave me names so far. I'm trying to think of some names that he gave me for our Weedle when we had it. Oh, obviously we still have it when we first caught it. And I think one of them was popcorn because it kind of looks like, um, like pop the popcorn on the string that people put around the tree. My only problem with that is when it evolves, it doesn't even look anything close to that. Um... Let me just Google a Christmas butterfly. See what we get. Good old Google machine. So let's see. Christmas butterfly. There's apparently a Christmas butterfly, let's see, poem. Let me click on that and see what that says. Uh, these are just ornaments with butterflies and poems on it, not specifically a Christmas butterfly poem. Um, you know, I'm not finding anything. I don't know. Let's see. For protection, it releases a horrible stench from the antenna on its head to drive away enemies. Yes, give him a name. I'm going to go ahead and just call him Popcorn for now. Um, if you guys can think of something better, let me know. There we go, Popcorn. Right, what else is in this? Is there another Caterpie? You won't get far in the woods unless you can cut down small trees. Well, hopefully we'll find the move for cut pretty soon. Oops, too far. Dang it. Alright, so let's go ahead. Whoops. I'm going to take the experience share from Eric Carl and give it to Popcorn here. And we'll continue on. Um, I think, like I said, I think we'll go ahead and use Popcorn for now. Um, as soon as we find something maybe else, I'll take out Eric Carl first. Because, again, like I've said three or four times already, I do like um, Butterfree better than uh, Beedrill. Always have, always will. Hey, check out my Zigzagoon. Okay. Ah, oh, I'm just so... We lost two. We lost two Pokemon. I'm still so disappointed. I mean, present I wasn't too excited for. I understand. But, I mean, the pickup ability is nice. It's very nice. Um, I'm going to use a sand attack. And so I was really, I'm really disappointed to lose that. And But Poinsettia. I was looking forward to using uh, Poinsettia. So that's very disappointing. So now it's Powder Snow. There's a crit. Alright, we got we're switching out. Peppermint just I don't know, Peppermint needs to get better. It's just really not that good right now. I've never used a um well any of the evolutions never used um Swinub, 
uh, was it pillow swine and a mammoth swine. Never used any of them, so I don't know how good they are. I know mammoth swine is supposed to be really good. Um, but I'm not really too impressed right now with, uh, with pillow swine here. Wait, no, is that the right? Swine up, swine up, whatever. Pillow swine is what he evolves into. What are you doing? Hey, I heard you saved all those Delibird back in Azalea. As a token of my appreciation, appreciation, I want you to have this HM. And we got Cut. Uh, I'm probably going to cut, teach Cut to um, Eric Carl, our B drill. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Because, again, I don't really plan on keeping him on the team probably for super long. Think, I'm pretty sure Beedrill can learn Cut. I would think it could. Oh, yeah. It's either Beedrill or Rudolph, apparently. Again, another one of the great things. I do love that there's a Name Raider and a Move Deleter in every single town. Or in every single Pokemon Center, anyway. That's awesome. So, I can get ready to Cut at any time. What's this way? So, I'm confused. This, hopefully, I think this probably leads to a dead end or something, maybe. Is that a Heracross? Seriously, a Heracross? I'm not staying in, no. I thought about seeing how much a, uh, a uh, Powder Snow does, but it's not worth it. Corn Attack. That might kill. Nope, almost though. There we go. Never got to level 17. I'll use, like I said, our rare candy to get him up to level 18. And popcorn's evolving already. Get a powerful Metapod. Powerful. Yay! See, now it doesn't look like popcorn, so that's why I'm like not so sure about the nickname. Um, where is our rare candy? There it is. Level 18. I think we're gonna need all the levels we can get. There's an item over here. A ladybug. I would have been okay with a ladybug. I've never actually used one before. I don't think they're that good, but you know, I'd have been okay with one. A revive that is worthless to us. What's this? It's a glowing mask. This is how we get, um, wait, expose a Pokemon to it. Interesting. So I don't even have to, like, so all I have to do is expose the Pokemon to it, like, to expose Eevee to it. I don't actually have to, like, level it up around it, because there's no grass around it. Well, I guess it doesn't have to be grass. It's a forest. Interesting. A Zigzagoon. Alright, um... Maybe that's for, like, a Celebi or something like that later. So there's Celebi's little like shrine thing, right? That's what it is, isn't it? I like Forest Shrine. It's an honor of the forest protector. Yep. Ooh, I'd be okay with Paris even too. I like Paris. Again, Paris isn't that strong, but I like I like using him. I think he's kind of a cool looking Pokemon. So I really have no idea how long it's been recording. Um I want to say we're probably at 25 minutes, so I might wrap it up here pretty soon. Butterfree. You know what, Butterfree? I don't like you right now. Level is he? Level 11? Let's just see how much, how well Rocco would do against a Butterfree. Confusion. Oh, that's going to do a lot. Duh, I'm, st I'm stupid. That was stupid. Ah, I feel so dumb. You know, I'll just not root off. 
I guess it's a good thing we got Rudolph, guys. I don't know why I'm having so much difficulty in this. Like, I feel like it shouldn't be that difficult of a game. Ah. Uh, I was thinking that was Tackle. So, yeah, like I said, I don't know why I'm having so much difficulty in this game. You can't see the sky. Please watch out for items that may have been dropped. Hello, I'm a move tutor. Want me to teach Megahorn to one of your Pokemon? Um, yes, please. It will cost you a heart scale for me to teach a skill. Is that okay? Yes. Choose a Pokemon. Anybody can learn Megahorn. Okay, I wanna. We're gonna think about this for a second. Um. Megahorn. Megahorn would be physical in this gen. I mean, it's physical anyway. So, who's got a really good physical stat? So, 21, 26, 20, 33, 60. I think we're going to teach Fishmas here. Because, I mean, I know he's the highest level. But, his, I mean, he's not a special attacker. It's 36 compared to 60. And it's a Gyarados. So, we're going to teach... Fishmas, Megahorn. I do have a hard scale thanks to our uh, our present. Gyarados cannot. Oh, what? Okay. So what? Tell me who can learn Megahorn then? How about that? That would be easiest. Um. You know what, I'm not going to do it right now. Um, maybe some other time, I guess. I just don't really want to race the heart scale. Because I feel like... I feel like... Maybe the only person that can learn it on our team is our bug type Pokemon. Maybe Rudolph can learn it. we got Bright Powder. Really interesting. Let's just go ahead and give that... You know what, let's just give it to Peppermint. Why not? So hopefully maybe we get some misses then. Alright. I'm going to come around here, see what's over here, and then we're going to call this an episode, I think. Well, you know what, this might be a longer episode. That's okay. I don't. Th hopefully you guys don't care. Um, I think we're just going to get... Until we get out of this forest. Drill. Again, I don't really have anything for a lot of this stuff. So we just gotta go out to Rudolph here. Wait, what? Wasn't that Twin Needle? That can poison? Huh, interesting. Peppermint grew to level 13. Pop him level 10, so here's going to be another evolution. So this will be a lot of uh, editing for me. That's okay, I don't mind it. There we go. Problem to Butterfree. And we got Confusion, nice. Alright. I want to heal up. Let's use potions. And antidote. Got 10 antidotes. Might as well use them. Alright, so like I said, I have no idea how long this episode is. So again, I hope you guys don't mind having a little bit longer of an episode than normal. Because I'm guessing that it probably will be longer. It feels like it's been longer. Um... Bayleaf? Seriously? You know what? Let's see how much powder snow does this Bayleaf. Okay, that wasn't too bad. We took that tackle pretty well. I might try to see if we can beat this Bayleaf. Alright, see how much we can take this Razor Leaf with. It should be resisted, right? No, it should be neutral. Yep, there he goes. 
I cannot catch a break, guys. I just can't do it. You know what? Screw it. We're staying in. Maybe we'll just do a Rudolph solo run. Why not, right? We're going to go ahead and give the Prite Powder to Rudolph, since Rudolph has to come in all the time and save everybody. So there's another death. Three deaths in one episode, guys. I think that's my record. That's my new record. Are you going to go around the city to check out the new global terminal? It's pretty cool. You should check it out if you weren't already. Thank you. There's a Butterfree. Oh, honey, you're making a Pokedex. It must be hard if Pokemon won't appear. Try using this TM. Well, it's TM12. Apparently it's time to make Pokemon appear. Is it like Sweet Scent or something? Yep, Sweet Scent. Blah, blah, blah. It's fine. Alright. We're going to call it an episode here. I'm not going to move anymore because who knows? We could run into something and all my Pokemon could be dead. Oh, my goodness, guys. If you guys, though, did enjoy this episode, you enjoyed seeing not one, not two, but three Pokemon die in one episode then go ahead and hit that like button. I mean, even if you didn't like seeing that and you enjoyed the episode anyway, still, hit that like button. If you didn't like the episode and you don't want to hit the like button, you want to hit the dislike button instead, that is perfectly fine. You can go ahead and do that. Just please, I ask, you know, if you do do that, um, let me know in the comment section why you didn't like it and maybe I can improve on it um, for next time. That way I can hopefully become a better YouTuber that way. Um, like I said, I'm all, I, I can usually say I'm always up for some, some, some constructive criticism. Um... If you haven't yet, though, guys, make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a moment of all this exciting action. Um, and I do have uh, quite a few new subscribers, which I'm, you know, I welcome you guys to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. I really do appreciate it. Um, hopefully, you guys like what you see, which is why you subscribed. Um, also, make sure if you haven't yet, make ch go check out my Pokemon Platinum um, second chance lock I've got going on. Um, we had a difficult time in that in the episode that got uploaded right before this as well. So if you haven't seen that yet, go check it out. Um, and finally, leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you have any good nicknames for uh, for popcorn here. Um, anything better than popcorn? Um, something having to do with maybe a butter for you know a butterfly or something. I don't know. Uh, but let me know if you have any good you know good nicknames for him. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna get out of here. I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'm gonna see you guys next time.